you guys. I think I did it right that time. I think I was able to play the intro. Yeah. All right. So, you guys, I was actually pretty shocked when I saw a picture of James over on the interwebs. I actually didn't even think that it was James at first. I was like, who is this little boy behind Andrew? And it was James. And the reason why is because he looks so grown. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the photo and then we'll talk about everything and why. I was like, hold up. Did Andrew Glennon just violate like their custody arrangement, their custody agreement? Is he going to get in trouble? So let's go ahead and let's look at the photo of, I always call James Baby James. Did the intro play for anybody else? I always called, uh, when I used to cover this topic, I would always call him Baby James. But now he's not a baby. Look at him. Does he not look like Leah at that age, though? So he is almost five, I believe. I think he'll, I think he'll be five in May. So if you really think back to Leah when she was younger, like just throw some blonde hair, like a longer blonde hair on him. And I think he looks like Leah. Now, you guys, he's clearly... Been hanging out with his dad a little too long because look at this shirt he has on. He is dressing, Andrew is dressing James in his style of clothing with the Hawaiian style shirts. It's pretty funny. It's like mini Andrew, I guess, but he looks like Amber, not Andrew, but he's dressing him the same way. So you guys, let's get into this. Yeah, I was shocked to see the photo. I was definitely shocked to see the photo. So let's get into everything. Not a toddler anymore, I know. All right, so I am curious to see what Amber says about this. And I, I was like, oh, I got to check Instagram to see what she says. Um, and I forgot while I was planning this. Let me hop on over to Instagram and see if she has anything to say about this. All right. No. Nine hours ago, there's always a different path. That's it. No, she hasn't said anything about this. Um, it makes me wonder, though. Definitely makes me wonder how she feels about this because he there was a legal agreement that neither one of them could share photos of Jake. He couldn't be on the show and they could not post any photos of him. Now, I will say um, it's being said that this photo was posted on um Andrew's private social media account. But here's the thing. You cannot trust people. You cannot trust people. So I follow um I follow Andrew on like Instagram and stuff, right? And he has a lot of followers over on Instagram. So I have a feeling that he has like a public Instagram and a private Instagram, like a public Facebook and a private Facebook. However, if you are in a private, if you have a private account and you're like Andrew Glennon and nobody has seen your son in years and you post a photo of your son, I mean, I'm sure the son paid for this. So whoever is friends with Andrew Glennon on his private Facebook account and got this photo, more than likely sold it to the son, made a pretty penny off of it, and now it's out there. So honestly, if I was Andrew, I know it's hard not to post pictures of your son because you're like proud of him. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You're proud of him and you want to show your son off. But unfortunately, nothing ever stays private. It's been, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. So, yes, James turns five in May and he's been living um, with his dad out in Malibu in Andrew's, on Andrew's mother's property. So, Andrew's mother has a five million dollar estate in Malibu and they moved there last August after a judge um, granted Andrew full custody Andrew requested for them to move and obviously that was something that, that Amber contested she did not want to see James move she lives in uh, Indiana he was going to be moving to, to California so that was something that she did not want to see happen however it happened once Andrew was granted full custody. The judge allowed him to move. 
I bet Andrew sold the photo to the sun. Maybe so. Maybe so. You never know, you know. So the sun is reporting that James's new life uh, in Malibu is a lot different than what it looked like in Indiana. Probably so. Um, and even though they are far apart, Amber is making it a priority to see her son. She has her full overnight visits with James. And this was something that the court set in place for their custody arrangement to go in phases of three separate phases where she would see him uh, like two or three days out of the week, but no overnight visits. And then it would move up to like three or four days out of the week. No, no, no overnight visits. And then it would go to like five days. And she would have him for like five days and it would go into overnight visits. And that's what she has him now. So she has him five days a month, overnight visits, but they alternate between California and Indiana. So right now she actually has um, baby James from my understanding. And I don't know if she has him in California or if she has him in Indiana, but say she has him in Indiana right now, next month she has a fly to California. Yes, she has the fly to California to get her five, to, to be with him for the five days, you know. Um, so sources are saying that when Amber is not with James those five days out of the month, she, she talks to him on FaceTime a lot to, you know, bridge the gap between the visits. Um, so she's been trying, putting in a lot, of, a lot of effort to make sure that she is a part of James' life despite the distance. She's making it work. And this just goes into the custody the custody war between Andrew and Amber. He was granted sole custody in July, relocated to his mother's $5 million estate in Malibu. So she has like a main house. And then on the back of her property, there's a guest house to which Andrew and little James, baby James, toddler James, miniature James lives in. Um, there were rumors that Amber was fired or that Amber quit team mom. And from my understanding, those things were not true that uh, she actually didn't quit. She wasn't fired. And when those rumors come out, she was actually filming for the show at the time. So I've heard rumors and that the show was canceled. To my knowledge, the only one that I have heard for certain that is canceled is Team Mom YMP. Uh, that is like for sure canceled from my understanding. The other shows I've not heard for sure if they're can canceled. But recently when they were filming, she was filming for the show. So she is still and the rumor was, was that she got fired for that phone call that leaked between her and Ashley Jones. Um, she called Ashley Jones mad over thinking that, Anne, that Ashley twerked at them when they were leaving the reunion. And she called Ashley basically to get on to her for that. And Ashley was like, F you, I don't care. You're nobody. You're irrelevant. And Amber really popped off and was like, I'm going to take you out. I'm going to whip your butt. I'm going to be fired. Blah, 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 blah. And after that phone call leaked, it was said that she was fired. And then it was like, hold on, she, she, no, she wasn't fired. She wasn't fired, but she's thinking about quitting the show. And then it's like people come out, sources close to Amber came out to say, not only is she not fired, but she's not, not, she's not quitting the show either. She actually is filming right now. So, yeah. At the last um, reunion, which was, uh, it aired December 2022. Uh, Dr. Drew asked Amber, so what are your thoughts as you watch that? And it was, um, I think she was watching a clip about the custody situation. She just said that um, she was right, not ready to really go there and discuss all of that, everything with James. And we all know that she's been on the show since 2019 when she was pregnant. Her daughter Leah is now 14. So, I mean, this has been her job for 14 years. Do you think you always call him baby James? I think it's because we've not seen. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'll always call him. But I, I mean, I don't know. Maybe now, maybe after seeing this photo, if any other photos come out showing him older and older, then maybe not. But baby James is just what came out. Like I always called him baby James. I don't know. Look at him. Look at how cute. So I am still curious um, when they actually right after amber was arrested for you know the um a b u s e on andrew they were both told y'all cannot film him y'all cannot put any pictures of him 
That was early on. That was 2019. Okay. Now this photo comes out. It makes me wonder, since he was posting it to his private Facebook, Facebook account, could he get in trouble for that? Or if it was more one of those things that you can't post it publicly. And because maybe his private Facebook account is kind of locked down or his private, um, his private Instagram account it is private. If it's kind of locked down and it's only certain people that's in it, can he get in trouble? Here's the thing. Amber Portwood really can't have like private accounts. Like no matter if she did try to, like I feel like people would get into them. You know what I'm saying? That's what I thought too, Nat B. I thought that she was like, I thought I was like pretty certain that she was fired. So before I went live, I was like, hold up, let me look into this. Let me double check, see if she was fired. And the most recent article that I could find was actually saying that she wasn't fired. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. So this was um, February 4th, 2023. Amber Portwood officially quits the show after 14 years and will soon make an announcement. But that announcement never came. <laughs> um, this one says, this was a source. Amber's officially leaving Team Mom. This was her own decision. She was not fired. And she will be making an announcement within the next few days. A call to MTV was not returned. Um, Amber has been telling her friends that she was going to say that she was ready to say goodbye to the show. Insider claimed Amber has told people she is absolutely out of the show, that she is ready to quit and gave notice to MTV. Here's the thing. A lot of times when they give their notice to MTV, you know, they'll be in a disagreement with the producers of the show or something, and they'll give their notice, and then they decide not to quit. You know, Kale threatened to quit many times before she actually quit. Uh, several of them have threatened to quit and then came back. Uh, so let's see. This one was, what was this one? Okay. So... Amber Portwood has not been fired by MTV and Mint Rumor, Ashley Jones feud. The end of an era, rumors are swirling that Team Mom OG Amber Portwood was fired after an alleged feud with Team Mom The Next Chapter co-star Ashley Jones. A source tells in touch, she has not been fired. Um, they are still working out. Out of it, they are still working, that they are still working out if she will continue with the show. The insider claims that Amber and MTV are not seeing eye to eye on some things. Things there are things she loves about filming, and there are things that are really challenging about being on the show. While Amber, Amber and the network work, up, work out their different differences, the Indiana Native co-stars have begun filming for the upcoming season of Team Mom The Next Chapter. Let's see. Amber's absence from the long-running reality, reality series comes after a heated conversation between her and Ashley um, was leaked on social media. After filming on the family reunion, special wrap in L.A., October 2022, all of the moms, minus Ashley, boarded two vans to leave the set. According to the Ashley, Ashley realized who was in the vans, and as they passed her, she began doing her signature twerking moves. Amber was reportedly furious and called Ashley, who claimed to begin, who claimed to have been recording a TikTok video, which she was because she put the video up. In the phone conversation, a clearly heated Amber threatened to have Ashley kicked off the show. You're gone. Your money's out. B-I-T-C-H, you're gone. Next effing season, watch. You act with the wrong one. Amber and Ashley's drama occurred on the heels of the uh, nursing student's drama with fellow co-star Brianna and Aya Elliott. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. So this was like she's not. One was she's fired. Then it was like she's not fired. Then it was like she's quitting the show. So I don't know. I don't know. Um, let me hold on. Let's let's see this really quickly because I feel like the Ashley can give us some solid advice. The Ashley reality roundup. So let's go. Team Mom. See if we can find anything. He threatened to quit every season. Appalachia said, my friend's brother was on, on one of those. Share living things in the 90s. He threatened to quit every season. That's pretty, pretty funny. I'm back one month ago and I don't see anything on the Ashley about it, but two months ago.
January. All right, I found an article from January 20th, 2023. This is from the Ashley. Rumors are swirling that Amber Portwood has been fired or quit the show. So the Ashley has gone to her behind the scenes source to find out what's going on. The rumors started after the Sun posted a story, story earlier this week stating that Amber was telling people that she was leaving. From there, it was stated by several Team Mom Instagram accounts that Amber was actually fired due to that threatening phone call. The Ashley has been working to get the real story behind the rumors and can confirm that as of press time, Amber has not been fired and she has not quit despite contrary reports. According to numerous behind-the-scenes sources who spoke to the Ashley, it is true, though, that Amber has not been filming for the next season, despite other cast members filming recently. This was due to her getting in trouble with MTV over the phone call. Okay? The Ashley will do her best to give some background as to what brought things at this point. Okay. The Ashley broke the news in October that filming between Team Mom and Family Reunion was a chaotic mess after Ashley, who was not permitted to film with the other girls, Twerked at the bands as the co-stars pa co passed. Amber was furious, called, and texted Ashley to let her know. The call was leaked. Amber can be heard screaming and cussing, threatening, threatening to mutilate. <laughs> uh, Amber also told Ashley that she would be fired for the next season. Team Mom Shave Room reported on Thursday that the call got both Ashley and Amber in trouble with Team Mom or with MTV. And it was sent to the network higher-ups to be dealt with. The Ashley sources says that is true. Amber, Amber was not filming because of this mess, particularly a few of the things she said on the call being found extremely problematic. Um, Ashley has, has began filming as of press time. Amber is not, but things are still being worked out. Okay. All right. That's the only thing I can find on the Ashley. So I can't find anything that's any anything recent. Like January, February is the only thing that I can find. So I am curious, did she start filming? So, I know B, all these girls were so young, it should have been advised regarding investing their money, taxes and the like. Yes, because a lot of them did not pay their taxes properly. Like Kate and Tyler, um, Amber, who else? I feel like a lot of them owe taxes. In T ways, you guys, I wanted to show y'all this adorable picture of baby James, who is not so much of a baby anymore. So adorable. Looks a lot like Leah. Um, I have a few more things that I wanted to talk about tonight. I wanted to do a quick video about Vanderpump Rules reunion, how Ariana showed up to slay at the reunion in a dress. Oh my gosh, if you guys have not seen it, it's barely there. So, Stuart, Becky, one L, let me get a shout out. Love your channel, girl. Thank you so much, Stuart, Becky. Shout out. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, yeah, Leah was behind on her taxes. So you guys join me right back here. We're going to do a quick video to show off uh, Ariana's dress. Now, mind you, when they filmed the reunion, she already knew what was happening. So if she did not have that dress picked out before, <laughs> I think she picked it out afterwards to be like, you know what? I'm going to slay. He's going to be so tall like his daddy. Do you think Ever ever be back on? Maybe she could do the remake of the couch. <laughs> We need schools to cover taxes and finances. That is true. That is true. Okay, you guys. Um, I don't know. I, I kind of want to do a hangout tonight, too, but I have several things that I want to do. I also want to do an update of the Madeline McCann situation over on the Bass Chat. And then I kind of want to do a hangout, but I can't stay up too late. Um, I have to go to physical therapy in the morning at like nine. Um, anyways, you guys, join me right back here. It's going to be a quick video. Raquel, her revenge dress. Not why do I always want to call her Raquel? Ariana in her revenge dress. Join me back here in a few minutes. I love you guys. I'll see you guys very soon. Give this video a thumbs up. Please, when you're out, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. I will see you guys in a few
Bye, everyone.